guys, I'm Tyrone and welcome back to Harrison Family Farm. It is a Saturday morning here on the farm. I had to think about it real quick. And it's a pretty uh, damp one. Now, nah, I'll show you guys. Pretty wet on the farm. We got a lot of rainfall uh, the last day or so. And so uh, it's actually, as you can see, I haven't completed the doghouse either. Uh, shame on me, but it's been wet like the last several days, actually. Um, however, with it being Saturday, one thing I am going to do is try to locate uh, the material that I'm going to use for sheathing the doghouse. I know I mentioned to you guys last week that I was kind of in between or undecided about which material to use. I'm still in that boat, but one thing with hash tank is uh, I want to try a particular store uh, as far as looking for the materials that I want to use. And that story, I don't know if it's just local to us or if it's a national thing, but uh, it's called the Restore, and it is a branch of the Habitat for Humanity. And so a lot of contractors take unused uh, materials there and then they in turn usually sell them at discounted prices. And so uh, I'm going to swing by there. We actually have, have a couple of their stores here in the city. And so I'm going to swing by hopefully at least one of them just to get uh, just see for one if they have any sheet siding, because I think that's what I'm leaning towards, like the smart uh, smart lap siding or whatever the case may be. Uh, see if they have some of that uh, and if they do at what price point and kind of just wait my options and go from there. Um, Another thing that I want to do on uh, this weekend, if it'll, if uh, the weather allows me, because like I said, it's wet, is I need to uh, probably move my green trailer that you guys see in most of the videos in the intro and everything. Uh, we are going to try our hand at, well, I say we, but it's really Angela that's spearheading, spearheading this child to her, bless her heart, but uh, she wants to host, and, and I, I'm definitely on board, but she's the mastermind is what I'm saying, but uh, she wants to host like a litmus. And so uh, it's going to be basically just family, a bunch of my, my cousins and a few uh, friends that she has. And I say it like that just because if you guys know or maybe you don't know, uh, Angela's a transplant. She uh, uh, moved here from Texas. And so, yeah, she doesn't have uh, any family here. So, yeah, it's going to be a bunch of my cousins, a few of her friends. And uh, I say that to say that I need to make some room for additional parking. That's that's what I'm getting at. So I want to move that trailer uh, to a different location. Not sure yet, but again, with it being wet, it might not happen today. So we're just going to kind of take it as it comes. I just wanted to take a moment, kind of open up the video, and then we'll see what we get into today. So I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Uh, and also, don't forget, hit the like button, hit it on your way in. That, that really helps us out. Uh, be sure to uh, subscribe and share. I figure I'll say it on the front end of this video rather than wait to the end. All right, guys, so I'm checking back in. We are at Lowe's and uh, we we're looking for some sheet goods. There's Isis. There's Angela. We're actually just coming from um, breakfast. I was duped into taking these <laughs> lovely young ladies uh, to breakfast this morning. And yeah, they're raving about it, but we're looking for some sheet goods so that we could uh, finish off our dark house. We didn't quite find what we we're looking for here. So we are headed, I believe, to the restore to see what they have.
Hey guys, so uh, it is now Sunday. So yeah, a little bit of time has passed since uh, we were last in the store. Uh, just to kind of catch you guys up, if you saw we visited, visited several stores. I want to say that we went to Lowe's, we went to a store here called Cargo Largo. <clears throat> uh, we also went to the, uh, the ReStore. And so long story short, we actually ended our Saturday uh, not actually purchasing any materials for the uh, for the doghouse. Um, Lowe's, of course, had material, but I just wasn't uh, really excited about the price point. I kind of mentioned to you guys before. And then with the restore, they didn't really have anything that we were looking for, as well as um, what's the third one we went to? Cargo Lava. They didn't have what we were looking for either. So, uh, like I said, today is now Sunday. It's Sunday afternoon. It's actually uh, getting into Sunday evening. It's about four. Uh, but we do have our material for our doghouse. So unfortunately, uh, I'm gonna just let you guys know now in this video, we're not gonna get to uh, install it, which is all right. I'm just so happy to have it. Uh, that way we can just kind of kind of put that behind behind us. Uh, I ended up just getting it at Lowe's. Um, I did some, after yesterday, I came back home, did some online kind of research. Uh, something I should have probably started out doing in, to begin with, but I didn't. Excuse me, so I looked online uh, and just kind of compared like, I, and again, I was really motivated by uh, by price. I didn't want it to be very expensive because the, the sheet siding, it gets uh, expensive quickly. Uh, and so um, going from like a, just a simple doghouse build uh, can turn into a several hundred dollar project really, really quickly. Um, but nonetheless, we're here now and we got it secure. So the, the next thing is to do is to install it, hoping to get to that um, this week. Uh, it's kind of one of those things um it's just for reference it is the week leading into uh the christmas uh holiday christmas is going to fall on a monday so this is the we're about to come up on the monday prior to if i'm not mistaken if i'm not mistaken about christmas being on monday i mean um so yeah so i said that to say that i got a lot of last minute things i need to do kind of at work some projects to finish up before the uh for the holiday hits, it's frankly, some homeowners that need their homes uh, back in pristine condition before they have possibly have guests coming over. So I said that to say that I'm, I'm pretty busy right now, but I'm still going to see if maybe if I can get done uh, early evening or something and the weather is decent, if I can go ahead uh, and get this stuff installed. It shouldn't actually take me that long. I just know that today's probably not going to be great because, like I said, it's already past four. Uh, and by the time I get the, the tools and equipment and stuff out, it's already going to be time to pack it up. Uh, so, yeah, I'm not even going to bother. One thing I'll probably do is get it unloaded, get it situated somewhere because uh, I'll probably be hauling materials for work tomorrow. So I need my bed, bed of my truck back. Um, but, yeah, guys, I am going to um, spend the, rem the remaining of the day, the daylight portion anyway, just really getting the animal situated. Uh, let's get these garage doors closed for now. <laughs> But getting the animals situated, uh, the cow should be out of hay or close to it. Beyonce's been mowing her head off. I'm, I'm sure I'm tired of her. I said, I'm tired of her. I'm sure the neighbors are tired of her as well. Uh, and she's right here looking at me with all the sass and attitude. And it looks like they're actually not quite out of hay. Not just yet. I'm looking down here and I can see a uh, brown yard calf with a mouth full of hay just chewing. Uh, as well as Jay, he's looking at me too. They've both been over here eating. So Beyonce, she's the more particular one. Um, but nonetheless, I'll turn you guys around. Nonetheless, they are ready for a new bell. Don't look inside the bell feeder. Uh, I actually moved it. The hay was actually where Jay is standing, or where Brown is standing too. And so I just moved it this morning so they could finish it off. Uh, uninhibited, you know, not being inhibited by the uh, bell bill feeder so i'm going to lure them back sorry i'm going to lure them back onto the other side with some feed like i always do use the bell feeder block them off uh i won't <clears throat> take you guys along for that i've done it several times but yeah guys uh thank you guys for tagging along with me this weekend be sure to like subscribe and share uh be sure to tune back in hopefully and uh our next installment we'll be putting the the sheathing or the siding on to the uh, doghouse. Weather permitting, time permitting, we shall see. But uh, regardless, we'll see you guys on the next video. Have a great week and uh, peace.